Singapore is moving closer to its goal of getting all HDB towns ready before electric vehicles by 2025. The Land Transport Authority is calling for a large-scale tender next month to install 12,000 EV charging points at nearly 2,000 HDB car parks. It's also upgrading its transport app to help users find EV charging points more easily. Rebecca Mateo reports. <laughs> An electric car charger could just be around the corner of an HDB block near you. The Land Transport Authority wants 3 to 12 EV chargers at each HDB car park within three years. In announcing these plans, the Transport Minister says LTA will also carry out electrical upgrades at car parks to pave the way for 60,000 charging points by 2030. The transition to electric vehicles is a key thrust in our greening of our land transport system. It will touch all our lives, whether we are motorists, fleet owners, workers in the automotive industry, or commuters. That is why we are launching today's campaign to create a shared vision and empower everyone to actively contribute to an EV-ready future. For the tender, LTA will look at how proposals for charging services would be reliable, affordable and sustainable. But the agency and operators acknowledge that a road to EV readiness would be an uphill climb. One challenge is to ensure that there's enough power supply. The car parks were originally designed with very basic amenities in mind, right? Uh, you have elevators and, uh, and the power supply is also used to run the lights in car parks. But now with this transition to have more EV chargers in HB car parks, the power supply becomes a vital bottleneck. We need to be able to find cost-effective solutions to bring up the power supply to each and every HB car park in Singapore. Another operator, CDGNG, says it is also important that charging points are near the power supply room. They'll help reduce the area that is cordoned off to residents during installation. Also to come, a new one-stop platform on LTA's transport app to help EV drivers find charging points across some 200 locations instead of having to navigate around different apps run by different operators. For now, an app by the Land Transport Authority will help EV drivers to find one out of the some 800 charges across the island. It will show key details such as charging prices and type of plug. In time to come, authorities will also add new function like the availability of charging points in real time. The government hopes these efforts will help the country phase out petrol and diesel vehicles and have cars run on cleaner energy by 2040.